Hey, Radical fans, uh, Phil here. and I'm Andrew. And Andrew, we have a good topic today. Um, people asking, when should you actually fit maybe a youth bowler for fingertip grip? Um, you know, I remember when I was younger, my first thing, I, was, I didn't start bowling until I was out of college, so okay. that's not fair. You okay. know, uh, and, and I didn't have a fingertip grip Still right away. Still a while ago. It's a while ago, yeah. You know, but um, the fingertip grip was probably my second ball. The first one was just a... Actually, the first ball I drew was a semi-fingertip, which okay. was hard to describe because there's no joint where the semi part was. So you yeah, like yeah. put your hand in a ball where there's no place to bend. But then gradually stretched it out. But you draw balls for your, your students. And yeah, and I find that the sooner you get into fingertip, the better. Okay. I mean, like Because I would rather them use grips than just the holes right. itself, uh, you kind of wait until their fingers are big enough for our small size grip. Yeah, yeah. The age is generally around 10 to 12. Um, but it's always good to just get a ball that fits you regardless. So you, uh, you recommend drilling, well, obviously you work for a grip company, to put grips in a ball uh, at an early age, right yes. away, right? Not, yeah. not drill a... Get used to the feel of it. Feel of um, it. Yeah. And a fingertip grip versus a, your general conventional grip that you'll find on your house rack at your, right. your league or when you go open play, yeah. um, the release is completely different. Sure. When you have a conventional release, you're taught to throw it off your hand, both thumb and fingers at the same time. Right. There's not really much of a roll to it. When you have a fingertip grip, your hand's in it in a way so that your thumb can come out first come out and first. then fingers. Right. And that's so important to sure. a release. Right. So the sooner that you can get that going, the better. Right. That's like, right. Uh, you know, I mean, this. if any young player in golf was to hit, like, a heavier club earlier, do you think they'll swing faster later on? Right, uh, probably exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. It, it's it's really just the sooner you get into it, the the more time the, right. you have to get the motion going. Right. That makes sense. But you can do a fingertip grip even before that right. without grips. You just do a generic hole that like what you grew up with. You never right. really had grips. No, you had, no. Yeah. You, the story that you said. Uh, you yeah, had I'll a tell garden it. Hose. I'll tell it. Yeah, the first grip we used. Uh, it's amazing. We used a garden hose. Yeah, you know, just cut a one inch garden hose, uh, three quarter inch garden hose, yep. one inch long, um, and slit the back, put, put it in it the in hole, there. and then keep trimming the back until it closed up and glue it in. And the beauty of it is it was that they were black, so you couldn't tell the guy had grips. Yeah. <laughs> in those I'm not going to call that a grip, okay? I'm going to call that. It's a, uh, a grip. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, so any, at any age, really, you can get a fingertip grip. Yeah. And the sooner you get fit for it, the better if you're one handed bowl with your thumb in it. Right. Uh, get used to the feel of it, right? Yeah. Um, yeah. But I would say like 10 to 12. Like 10 to 12 yeah. is the yeah. age I would start to really say to somebody, hey, if you're serious about getting them better, right. let's get them into the right grip. So let's do a. So here's the part, I'm going to bring it up because we're laughing. We did a topic earlier about when should a, you teach somebody to be a two hander. Yeah. So is it really called a fingertip grip if you're two handed? No. 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 <laughs> and you, you know what I find is a lot of two handers actually dig their fingers in far enough that they might as well be conventional. Right. Like a right. lot of two-handers do they that. Do. Okay. They dig in so far that their grips are so big anyway. Yeah. It's like you have yeah. the grip there more for texture right. than you do anything Yeah, I never else. thought about the two-hander. It, yeah. It's not really a fingertip grip. Yeah, you just, so. they have grips. They have grips. Yeah, just, yeah exactly. uh, it's just a grip. Right, right. Again, that was a topic written in. We appreciate all of the input, and we want your comments on it. And Tell us what you think about some of these things we talk about. And thanks for joining us. All right, thanks for tuning in.